Hey guys. Um, so this is the late, late, late night version. And I thought I would try something different um, for any of you night owls that are up like me. And we're going to paint in the dark um, just by the glow of the black lights. So anyways, no clue how this will work out, but I thought it would be something fun to try. So we're going to give it a go. All right, there we go. We are online. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> um, like I said, it's just an experiment. Who knows? Oh my gosh, Rebecca, El Spicy, everybody's awake. Okay, it's not just me. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Insert techno music. Um, <laughs> Anyways, so I have all of these, obviously, Midnight Glow paints, which are UV reactive paints. And then I have this, which is just a glow in the dark paint. And we're going to give this a go. I do have one light in here that is automatic, and I don't know how to turn it off. It will turn itself off in somewhere in the middle of the video. Yeah, glow sticks ready. Um... And I am almost out of Floetrol, so we're not going to be able to do as many colors as I would like. But, you know, it'll still be awesome. So here we go. <laughs> All of us are awake. We have issues. I know, right? Seriously. Seriously. But that's cool. It's, it's good to see all of you. Susie, Susie, Nate, and hi, I'm Bob, if you don't know that already. So, yeah. <laughs> Um, and these paints are all, you can get them, uh, on Amazon. So they're in my store in the description. Hey, Bridget. So yeah, you're going to watch, watch these, uh, cups start glowing as I mix. Watch that. It's like, there's like fireflies in here. It's so cool. <laughs> yep. Creative crew, hello and good morning, Joey. I know, wasn't that cool? Just watching that light up. All right, let's see. I have two more choices here. I think I am going to do a white. Which I'm curious what this white will glow as. Like what color. And let's see. Let's do... Hmm. Orange or green, orange or green. Is it's 4 30 p.m. there? Oh, you're lucky. It's well, it's only 11 30 p.m. here. Um, but other places it's definitely later. All right, let's do the <laughs> green. So neat. Yep, very cool. Um, you know what though? This one is green, mate. I'm going to start stirring this, and it's pretty green. This is the, the glow in the dark. It glows green. So I think I will just use that as the green. And then let's do an orange. <laughs> this is so much fun, you guys. I think this might have been a really good idea. Definitely always give me feedback. I love to know what you think. What do you have in the cups? That's why I just signed on with you. Um, flow trawl. Oh, I'm so sorry. Yeah, I already poured my flow trawl in the cups. So now I'm just mixing the paint into them. So this one's the blue. And realize, guys, in your lighting, it may look a little different than it is in real life. Like on the screen, this looks a little bit green, but it's very blue. Very, very blue. All right, let's get this orange mixed in. So I'm gonna mix all of these in and then I'm gonna add just a dash of water. Oh, thank you, Nate, you rock. Welcome Susan from Spain. Yeah, this is so cool. <laughs> This is going to be fun. Okay, now this is the white, the UV white. And look at that, it glows pretty white. 
and it's actually maybe a little bit maybe a little purple but that may be from the black light so welcome from Cape Town South Africa okay this is a fun fun color combo so I'm gonna just mix these all a little bit better this one's pink guys oh there we go the light just went off oh did you guys see that so now it's as dark as it gets in my garage all right this is the glow in the dark good <laughs> oh hey tina welcome a few of us have had a rough week including me and tina Tina definitely probably more so so this is always kind of a good way to unwind painting of course yeah pink 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 okay good so I'm gonna add a dash of water I didn't really think this part through of how I'm gonna add a dash of water in the dark I think I can see this enough <laughs> watch me dump the whole bottle if you hear a yelp it's because I dumped the whole bottle of water on myself. It's a little dark. Wow, I think I actually did that okay. <laughs> oh yeah, guys, don't forget the thumbs up. What, what? And take the cup with you for lighting. That would have been an excellent idea. All right, so I wanted to retry my um, neon tree ring pour since the last one got super dulled down however I feel like to work properly I do need to add a not glow in the dark color in here so yeah <laughs> can I get a what what yeah you can I don't see the invisible emoji okay I am going to use just a smidgen of black. And when I say smidgen, I mean really just that. All right, here we go. We'll start with some pink. Ooh, so exciting. And here is my smidgen of black. That's good. All right. And then... Here is the glow in the dark, which is not the UV reactive paint, it's just glow in the dark, and that's green. Um, this is the blue. And then this is the white. <laughs> hey, Stephanie Potter. <laughs> yep, what, what? All right, so that's the white. Now we're gonna add just another smidgen of black. Just tiny, tiny bit. There we go. <laughs> hey, drink the coffee. All right, here's the orange. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's do a little bit more pink. And let's see. I think I, have, I will have enough paint here to do one more. Okay, a little more white. All right, I think that's good. All right, let's go in with a little more of this green. All right, here we go. <laughs> I know, right? You have to have these paints. Good luck, Holly Ann. Um, Alex, I tried adding, um, a lot of black last time and it ended up being too much and it totally muted the colors. So this is going to be the coolest, like glow in the dark tree ring here. Watch this guys. Oh my gosh. I think that's enough. 
Oh. So here we go. <laughs> All right, I hope everybody has their screen in HD so they can see this as clearly as possible. And I help it along on the edges here. And then my hands are gonna glow in the dark. Okay, so cool. All right, guys, what do you think? That is pretty epic. Let me get all my corners. <laughs> it's so bright. <laughs> oh, hey, Deus. Hey, Jacqueline. Super cool. Okay, good. So that is number one. And yeah, let's go ahead and hit up another painting here and then just for funsies we'll turn on the lights <laughs> at the end and see how everything looks I'm just making sure I got all the edges yep all right so let me go ahead and grab another canvas I hope I don't activate that motion light but I might I'm a poet and I didn't know it all right hold on Oh, I can't find my way in the dark. <laughs> All right. You didn't hear any crashing noises, so that's a good sign. Okay. Canvas acquired, motion light not tripped. Excellent. We're doing good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, poetry. Some poetry. Um, how long does the paint glow and does it fade with age? Honestly, this is a new paint brand for me. Um, but it will glow for a long time. It's rechargeable. I know that exactly how long, I don't know. But it definitely will, will keep glowing over time. All right, so I have a little bit of paint left in my previous cup here. And so I'm going to just... Reuse this cup. This is a really like interesting painting experiment, you guys. <laughs> Doing this in the dark. Are there cells? Yes, there are little cells. Looks like. How do you get paint samples from manufacturers? That's a really good question. Um, I don't particularly know. I would maybe just write to them and ask. Um, I'm just gonna make this second one because then I will be out of this paint. And like I said, I do need to acquire more Floetrol, which is gonna be tomorrow. It's been just a psychotic couple of weeks and I haven't had time to do anything, so. Yeah, this would be a cool on a vase or coasters. <laughs> hey, Anita. Hey, Becca. Hey, Jennifer. Everybody. All right. Blue. Okay, one more. This is the glow in the dark. All right. I didn't really plan this out. Oh, I still have white. Please hold. Yep, there you go. In the cup. <laughs> Your daughter is transfixed. <laughs> That's awesome. This is fun, guys. Yeah, so that green is actually this glow in the dark. It's called Super Glow, and it's from Folk Art. Um, I don't have it in my store yet, but I will add it because it is so cool. I actually did a 
painting last night with it. I modified a painting and it was awesome. She's two. That's awesome, Megan. All right, I'm going to flip cup this one because why not? All right, here we go. <laughs> it's like a lantern. Oh, hey, Jenny. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Yep, flipped it. Have I ever tried Technoglow paints? I have not. Um, there's also like this resin um, glow-in-the-dark powder that I've been meaning to try. Uh, I even have like, I have an Amazon gift card that I've been meaning to use to order it. I've just been a little lazy. And I will check out Technoglow paints. Are they acrylic paints, Nate? Or what kind of paints are they? Here we go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Well, that escalated quickly. Okay. Oh my goodness. This is so stinking cool. Look at that, guys. That is so cool. And I am going to have the world's coolest runoff here that I'm going to have to figure out what to do with. Yeah. Yeah, that one looks even more like a galaxy and tons of cells, guys. You see all those cells? Okay. So here's what I'm going to do. I am going to, um, well, first I'm going to wipe my hands off. <laughs> Super cool. And then I'm going to try to grab my phone without tripping that, um, well, that foiled my plans for not tripping that light. So, oh well, here we go. I'm going to move this. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. So it's going to unfortunately be on for probably another minute or so, but... We can still tell. Yep, here we go. This one is just so cool. So cool. And here is the tree rink, which is pretty cool. Not as cool, but pretty cool. Yeah, right? Look at that. I freaking love that. Okay, so I'm going to put the camera back. We're going to be moving all around here, so close your eyes if you get dizzy. And then I'm going to turn on the lights so we can see how this looks in the light. All right. Get back on there. I know, right? So cool. Okay, guys. Here come the lights. Um, Joey, silicone has its place, definitely. But once you learn to um, mix your paints properly, I find you really don't need it if you get the right consistency. All right, guys, this is going to be blinding. So maybe close your eyes and then open them again. Oh. <laughs> okay. Man, everything's so much prettier in the dark. <laughs> wow, there's a lot of pink in there. That's a lot of pink. I still really love this one, but that is a lot of pink. <laughs> yeah. So, it's interesting how different it looks in the dark than in the light, right? I still love that one. And this one's pretty cool, too. It definitely has some really cool shapes and whatnot in there. Let me see. I'm going to move this a little bit. Move this a little. Okay. I think. <laughs> yeah, this one's not as nice in the light. But this one's still really cool. <laughs> Flip the light. Turn the light back off. <laughs> um. Yeah, there we go. 
I know. The blue disappears because the blue, well, the blue is in these cells. Let's turn the light back off. Yeah, there we go. So it's, it's popping through because it's like inside. Anywho, well, there you go. This was an experiment of painting in the dark. I hope you guys enjoyed it. <laughs> um, this is, let me get the box. Um, like I said, there is a link down in my store. Okay, I don't, oh, Midnight Glow. Here, I'll show you guys the box. You should be able to see it in this light. Here we go, Midnight Glow UV Reactive Paint. And it is eight different colors. So, there you guys go. Um, I will probably try this again. Yeah, another time, especially since you guys liked it so much. I'll be a little more prepared next time with more supplies and everything. <laughs> it was enlightening. You're so funny. Yeah, this is the paint that Allie sent me. All right, guys. Have a fantastic rest of your night. Get some sleep. And I will see you all next time.